what is going on guys PT Lime Game here back with another video today I'm doing like another vlog kind of it's a Lego vlog so if you don't want to watch this you can just skip all right over it but this is going out to tons of youtubers and tons of watchers to see one of the newest Ninjago legacy sets now I already have it I got it on December 27th and it is one that is supposed to come out on January 1st, 2019, but I got it in 2018. Ninjago is one of my favorite Lego brands. As you can see, if I were to show you up here, you can see ton this is my minifigure collection. I even have some of the more rare minifigures like this that you can only get on Black Friday events. See tons vehicles dragons yeah I like Lego a whole lot anyway back to down here some of the newer sets I have set number seven zero six six eight otherwise known as J storm fighter this is for ages nine plus or nine or more it has 490 pieces this is what the back side looks like of this set. This is the instruction manual. Yeah, we'll put that off to the side. These are your four minifigures. You got Lasha. As you can see, a new type of design from. Yeah, it's a little blurry. I don't know why. You got J. This is the new type of design. You could see the back and all that. The new nunchucks he has. You have Nia. Here's your little spear. I like the like per like the violet and light blue to it. And the new Pythor. He kind of has like gems on him. It's a newer version of him. Over here, you have a little stash chew type of thing where you could put Jay's nunchucks on. The nunchucks of lightning are one of the four weapon, like golden weapons of Spinjitzu. Put them on here. This here is the Vita Coal. You can open up the cockpit right here and put Jay inside, who is the main driver. Let me just bend up to put him inside. You could just put him inside just like this. There he is inside. Now, one of the features of this includes pulling this forward. If you were to pull this forward, it can act like this right here, which is very cool. It's like an adjustable thing. Then you could just bend both of these things inward to go like this again. There's some shooters. If you were to pull back this part right here, like pull it down, you could see shots. I don't know if you can see them that close. Uh, we can shoot. It's too fast for the camera to see. But yeah, one of the newer sets of Ninjago Legacy that are coming out. Honestly, I like the sets. It's only $40, and I got it out in a store. Somehow, workers must have put it out there early. I don't... So, Lego don't think... I never got it from Lego or anything. And Lego, if you're watching this video, don't think that I took it out of stores early. Because I did not. I kind of like the design of Ninjago Legacy. Looks actually very good. And as you can see, I'm in a bedroom, so you can see that this is no joke, that this is actually real and not some sort of fake set or anything. You can see I even have the instructions to show that it's not fake. You can see all the characters. 
might need to bend the camera down a little more, but you can see I have the four characters. Got the box. Now, the box design. I don't know why they put the Kai on it. You can see it's featured in season one. This is what it looks like. And so anyway, this video goes out to tons of YouTubers to show them how all this stuff functions. You can see all these functioning things on it. You can see this is the nunchucks of lightning. You can collect the other weapons. I think the nunchucks and the scythe are more, let's say, created than the other ones. But yeah, I am a Ninjaga fan, so you can see that I like this stuff. And I got it out early, just after Christmas, getting a Target gift card. And on an unrelated note, you got Fred in the background. From Fortnite. How you doing there, Fred? Anyway, back to the Ninjago. Yeah, I think it's very cool how they created it. A new created Pythor. I'll get, this is, so as you can see, this is the new Pythor. Yeah, kind of like the gem. Okay. Yeah, this is the new Pythor. And if I were to get this other one, this is the old Pythor. I actually created his own staff. Yeah, so that was the most recruited I could do. But yeah, this is the old Pythor. And this is the newer one. Yeah. Which is pretty cool. And then Lasha here, the girl version, the female version of the Venomari. Yeah, what it used to look like. Something a whole lot like this right here, as I should say. Something a whole lot like this. So right now, these minifigures, not many people have them, so they're rare. I'm one of the first people, maybe in the entire world, to ever do this set that's not like working with Lego or anything. But it's supposed to come out in 2019, but here I am in 2018 showing you this. I like the new designs of them. Obviously, they look very good. The new design, you can see if I were to flip them over here, they got the little sim their symbol on their back part. Yeah. Here's Pythor. If I were to take off his head, let me just take it off. You'd see the more gem part that makes him different from the original Pythor. So that's very cool. You got this little stand right here. Yeah, it's kind of cool too. It's very cool. The stand has the purple snake symbols on it. And then, of course, this. It's just that's in. You got here are the little details. I will show you all the details on it. I'm just slowly going to move the camera over each little detail. This is where you pull. This is a spot where you pull it back and then the wings function out. And then all you have to do is close both of these and it's attached in place. As you can see, if I were to do this out one more time, this thing goes up again. So yeah. The cockpit, yeah. Little details. I like this spot a lot. It looks really cool. Lightning things on the side. If I were to flip it over, this is what it looks like on the back. And if I were to flip it like this, you can see the little details like right through here. Right in here. So yeah. This is the instruction manual if you want to see what each thing is in the first part. Here, let me get some better lighting. In the first part. This is what it looks like in each part. First, second, third, and finally fourth. Got some instructions, as you can see. Yeah. 
I'm just gonna flip through all them as you can see like later on eventually I'm just gonna flip through a lot the pages now and after a while you'll have things this yes, you can see the little minor details and all that these are tons of little information things you can do to see. A couple other things. Yeah, here are all the pieces listed and making it. This is just the back side. Yeah, so anyway, that will have to do it for this video. If you are new to the channel, there are three things I have you all to subscribe, hit the bell for notifications on this channel, and like the video. And anyway, I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.